Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Yelena and I'm a mommy here on YouTube. I make a lot of lifestyle motherhood kind of videos and also a lot of motivation clean with me and cleaning videos. So today I'm gonna to be actually doing a very raw and unedited cleaning routine. This is kind of like my night cleaning routine when my toddler goes to bed. He's in bed right now, so I thought I would just show you what my house looks like usually on a, a nightly basis. And it's not bad or anything, it's just things like lying around. So I usually like to clean it up before I head to bed. I like to wake up with just a really nice like clean house and prepare my coffee the night before just like have everything clean and organized not wake up to a mess so yeah we're gonna have a very relaxing unedited just very raw and just yeah we're gonna clean clean up together and let's get started all right i'm gonna put you guys right here Okay, so in my bedroom, it's kind of a disaster because we're in the middle of moving, but I literally, like, this is disgusting, you guys. Like, dirty diaper, seriously, like, I'm so grossed out, but honestly, this is, like, real life. I'm a mom, and whenever my toddler is ready to go to bed and I'm changing him, this is what happens. So I know kind of gross. I'm going to go throw this away, and, yeah, let me know down below if you can relate because I feel like I am not going to, like, go to the trash while I'm changing my toddler. I just would rather put it on my nightstand. Just super disgusting and it's stinky. And then my toddler's clothes from today. Pick those up. His wipes, pick those up. His jammies from this morning, gotta pick those up. Because for some reason I didn't do it earlier and it's been one of those days I actually did not make my bed today which is like never happens um, my husband made it this morning but then I took a little nap in it just because I was like I was up at four in the morning so my bed's always made this is like a very rare occasion I know I'm getting into it so I probably don't have to make it but I'm just gonna like half make it if that makes sense all right just so it kind of looks good <laughs> okay Bed made. Let's go throw the dirty diaper away and put the laundry in here. Okay, throw this in here. There's like a ton of laundry in there. Also, this has been sitting here for like two days. I really need to fold that. And I just have been way too busy running around and not not being able to fold it. All right, I have to wash these. Okay. Paper towel. Okay, let's go ahead and wash these. Where can I put you guys? All right, I'll put you right there on my coffee maker. I hope you don't fall. This is like the struggle whenever you try to film. You're like, where do I put the camera? Okay, so usually I just, whenever the dishwasher is full and it's running, but whenever I just have dishes in here and I'm gonna hand wash them, I just put a rag down and I honestly usually don't even dry them. I just leave them air drying overnight. So that's what we're gonna do tonight. <laughs> Some Dawn, favorite soap. Not.
in my hand is starting to burn. Oh, I like to wash my dishes on like extremely hot water because I just feel like it gets all the germs and everything out better. But it like, my hands are literally used to it by now. It still starts hurting a little bit <laughs> because it's so hot. Ow. grandma taught me a really cool hack you guys if you have like a ton of oil on or like super greasy pots and pans what you do is you put soapy water in there or you put soap in there and then actually she told me not to use hot water because i i think she said it's supposed to it makes it even more greasy so she said you put cold water in there and it actually gets the grease out a lot faster so i have been doing that ever since and i feel like it works so yeah just a little thing if you want to try that i think it's like a little hack that i've just have done for a long time so i don't know if it actually does anything but it's what i feel like my grandma knew what she was talking about essential oils in my disposal before I go to bed because it makes the drain smell really good if you had food in there and it just stinks up everything so I like to put my this is the measurable difference essential oil it's lavender and I also have a peppermint peppermint one right here so both make it smell really good and I just really like having that and then If you guys watch my previous videos i mentioned that i got this just recently it's the mrs meyers clean day and it's the multi-surface everyday cleaner literally the best cleaner it smells so amazing and i just am obsessed with it it's all like natural ingredients made with plant derived cleaning ingredients essential oils so it just smells really good and i love cleaning with this I'll show you guys <laughs> makes everything seem so good. I wish you could smell it, but you should totally get some. All right, it smells so good. appliances before going to bed too. Make sure everything kind of smells good and is clean. And 
And I usually prepare my coffee for in the morning. I'll empty this little thing out and put water in there just so I can wake up and put my coffee in there and be all ready. I also like to clean this. This is seriously so gross. Look at that. That's disgusting. Sounds like straight coffee though. And then I just like to clean under here because it just gets coffee everywhere. So the kitchen's done. Okay, in the dining room, I don't have a lot of stuff here. I just have this coffee mug that I just had the camera sitting on. And then sock, lip balm. Usually put this stuff away. Probably should have washed this. the table because we just had dinner how cute are these you guys this is gonna be gonna be like my thanksgiving little um table decor these were all three dollars at target and these are super cute festive spices just different little candles i wanted to keep this really simple and then obviously I'm going to have really nice plates. But if you guys are looking for a little nice cheap Thanksgiving table decor. These are I think really cute. In the dollar spot. Shoes. I don't know why there's a shoelace.
process. I've been here for like a week because we're moving in a couple weeks. So my daughter loves playing in the room. So every single night, I literally do this every single night. I could probably move them, but I'm gonna be using them soon. Oh, there's another one. I missed one. socks our laundry basket like this is so embarrassing our laundry basket is in uh with the clean clothes in there so that looks like a hot mess Some toilet paper in here. Towels are a mess. All right, so this is after just a really super fast pickup. Not much change in here. The bathroom is picked up a little bit, just organized and things put away a little bit more. And then in here, pretty clean. I mean, this is how I like it to be every single night where it's not a hot mess. And then usually I'll put the dishes away in the morning and yeah, I just, I don't like going to bed with a super disaster kitchen. So this looks a lot better. Everything's pretty much cleaned up. This is basically my nightly routine. I honestly don't have energy tonight. It's been a long day. I don't have energy to put all that laundry away. So that's going to have to happen tomorrow. But yeah, other than that, it looks pretty good in here. Also not gonna do the floors because we just had to order a new vacuum, the other one broke. So that's what happened there. Not gonna be vacuuming for a couple days. So yeah, it looks pretty clean in here. So that is it for my kind of cleaning motivation or my everyday cleanup routine because I'm a busy mom with a toddler. So literally every single night I have to do this. I have to clean up his toys, pick up after dinner, dirty diapers, all kinds of stuff. So yeah, I wanted to show you guys a very realistic, unedited, very raw, um, stay-at-home mom cleaning kind of night routine. 
So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know I was kind of all over the place and you're used to seeing like speed cleaning from me, but I really wanted to try something different and show you kind of like more of a realistic side to cleaning and how it actually goes. And I mean, usually the other way it goes to like that too, but this is how I usually do it every single night. And um, this is how I clean every single night. So it's very realistic cleaning motivation i hope you guys enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up if you liked it let me know down below what you thought of it if you want to see more of these kind of videos more of the raw and uncut or do you guys like more of like the speed cleaning with a lot of just like music motivation let me know down below in the comments but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys next time bye guys